Breaking news impacting people right across the country. Optus customers being impacted by a mass service outage. Now, there are fears up to 10 million people could be affected. Live to Holly Stearns in Melbourne. Holly, what's the telco had to say? Well, Pete, they've had to say very little other than that they are aware of the issue and they're working to fix it. So we know this is, as you mentioned, impacting millions of people right across the country. Some are saying that it's the worst outage Australia has ever had. And now Optus, they have released a statement. Let's bring that up on the screen for you now. It reads, we're rare of an issue impacting Optus Mobile and MBN services and are working to restore services as quickly as possible. We understand connectivity is important and apologise for any inconvenience caused. I also want to read you a, a bit that they have on their website as well. They've written, our engineers are currently investigating a network fault that is impacting Optus Mobile and fixed customers. So, Pete, uh, there's lots of angry customers today and many people taking to social media to talk about the outage. We uh, believe that it was impacted from about 3am this morning. Lots of people saying that they're experiencing... Uh, a problem with connectivity. They were seeing an SOS sign in the top right-hand corner of their screen, which essentially means they were unable to make calls or texts or use the internet at that time. In Melbourne, it's been impacting the train network as well. All trains were brought to a halt. We believe, though, that they are back up and running but are expected to cause delays right throughout the day. Most people, though, are mad, though, that Optus hasn't come out and given a proper statement or given some proper answers here for people here today. It's impacting millions of customers and businesses too. Claire O'Neill, the Home Affairs Minister, she's come out and also released a statement. I want to read that to you now as well. She said, the government is seeking information from Optus on major outage. We understand from reports that the telco is working to resolve the outage as soon as possible. And we've been speaking with tech experts this morning as well. Trevor Long, he says that it's not good enough that the government has put out a statement really before Optus has. He says that this is the worst outage Australia has ever seen. It's fascinating that the Department of Home Affairs has spoken before Optus has because we've had no official statement from Optus about this other than some replies to people on social media saying they're aware of the outage, they understand the importance of communication and they're working to rectify it. But this is the biggest telco outage in Australian history. So, Pete, this is very much a developing story and I'll bring you more updates as they come to hand. But lots of angry customers across Australia today. Holly Stearns, thank you.